Diarrhea is a condition where our stool becomes watery due to an excess of water in it. It's a common condition that can occur several times a year for many people. Diarrhea happens when our small intestine doesn't function properly. In some cases, if diarrhea persists for more than three to four days, it can lead to a significant loss of water and electrolytes from the body, which can result in dehydration. If not treated properly, this can even lead to serious complications like kidney failure. Now let's explore why and how diarrhea occurs. Often diarrhea can be caused by side effects of medications, infections, allergies, or digestive disorders that disrupt the normal functioning of our small intestine. Diarrhea is usually associated with a condition where our small intestine cannot absorb nutrients and water properly. Since the small intestine isn't working, as it should in cases of diarrhea, electrolytes and water from the small intestine don't get absorbed into the bloodstream, but are instead released from the body with stool. This condition is called malabsorption. In contrast, maldigestion occurs when food, which comes from the stomach into the small intestine, is not properly digested, and it is also released from the body with stool. This results in a shortage of nutrients and water in the body, leading to dehydration. Dehydration can cause a significant decrease in the flow of blood to vital organs, increasing the risk of organ failure. Diagnosis and Treatment To diagnose diarrhea, doctors usually perform blood and stool tests after reviewing the patient's medical history and conducting a physical examination. These tests help identify digestive disorders and harmful microorganisms. In most cases, diarrhea resolves on its own within a few days. However, in some cases, patients are advised to drink plenty of fluids to prevent dehydration and antibiotics may be prescribed to kill harmful microorganisms.